Hi and welcome back to Vanguard Motor Sales. My name is Tom Fotios and today we're standing in front of a gorgeous 71 Cutlass drop top 442 clone with a big block, all the right stuff. We're doing this video for you today so you can make a great choice on your muscle car investment and don't forget to go to Classic Car Buying Secrets and download the 7 Deadly Mistakes to Buying a Classic Car Online. Once again, my name is Tom Fotios, and we can address all your overseas shipping as well and local United States shipping. Come on up and let's look at this beautiful car. Wow, what a gorgeous blue paint. It's like a medium blue metallic, uh, just stunning body lines on this car. Very, very nice paint. Um, it's got the fiberglass hood like the 442s. Very nice margins on the doors and everything. Look at this. Just one of a kind, guys. Don't miss out on the opportunity to cruise a Cutlass convertible this summer. Call me today. Don't miss out on this beautiful car. Check out all the beautiful chrome. Uh, the cool exhaust tips, the trumpet exhaust. Let's check out the trunk. Nice clean trunk. You got a spare tire. Look at the bottom of this trunk too. Even that, they did a very nice job. That's how you tell the quality in a car. Look under the trunk lid and look if they painted it good. Going down the passenger side, you see the same beauty as the driver's side. Unbelievable margins. Doors open and close real nice. Don't forget to visit us on our website at VanguardMotorsales.com and become social subscribers on YouTube, Twitter, and Facebook in the upper right hand corner of our site. Check out the beautiful clean door lips, the stunning, it's like a pearl white interior. Um, you got an aftermarket radio underneath the dash. It's operated remotely from a remote control. Um, just a fun little car. We're gonna do a little demonstration on how nice the convertible top works as well. Hi, now we're underneath this beautiful blue 442 clone convertible, and I tell you what, the underneath side is gorgeous. Let's take a quick look. Looks like we got a brand new gas tank. We've got a fairly new exhaust system that looks like it's in super awesome shape, just looks fantastic. Let's take a look at this 12 bolt rear end. Um, no posse here, uh, we've, but we do have a gigantic Hotchkiss. Uh, sway bar, lower control arms, upper control arms, and then we've also got these little braces that go from the upper control arms down to the front of the swing arms. Just a real nice setup on this rear end. Um, new shocks back here. Everything under here has been painted up real nice. Looks like they've used uh, some 415 on it. Uh, super job they did on this car. Let's take a look at the middle of the car. As you can see, we've got some Flowmaster mufflers here. Boy, does this thing sound good going through the Flowmasters with that big block up front. Just an awesome sounding car. Um, we've got a brand new uh, brake line here going front to back. Looks like the emergency brake cables are here. The fuel lines look like they're in real good shape. Don't see anything wrong there. Um, looks like my U joints are tight. Got a uh, Turbo 350 trans here. Take a look at these floorboards. These floorboards have been painted also. I don't see any signs of any patches. 
I don't see any rust. Looks like a little bit of scale here, but they've painted over all that with the 415. Uh, looks like it's in super shape under here for a convertible. The frame, super shape. I don't see any pitting. No rust on that frame. The rockers are all in good shape. My pinch weld looks good. Don't have anything wrong there. Both sides here. Pinch weld looks awesome. Let's go up and look at the front suspension. Alright, take a look at this front suspension. All the steering gear looks like it's in good shape. Again, we've got one monster sway bar up front here. Um, take, looks like new spindles, new calipers. They're, these backing plates look like they're fairly new. Looks like they did a whole brake conversion kit on this thing. Um, looks like the ball joints have been replaced recently. Um, everything up here looks real tight. Looks awesome. Whole bottom of the motor looks nice and clean. It's got a good paint job on it. This baby's super clean underneath. It's a uh, 1971 Cutlass Convertible 442 clone. Take a look under the hood of this baby. I tell you what, she's gorgeous. Super clean. These inner wheel wells look super shaped. Don't see anything wrong there. Looks like the water pump's been replaced recently. Great big old uh, 455 Olds motor. Boys, this thing have the power. I'll tell you what, we've got that um, cold air induction uh, air cleaner on this thing with the cowl hood. Super, super car. We've got a, looks like a brand new wiper motor over there. Also a new power booster and master cylinder. Um, that brake upgrade probably came with the new power booster, master cylinder, spindles, calipers, whole front brake setup. Uh, we've got all the air conditioning stuff here. Uh, looks like the clutch is out on the AC compressor, uh, so the belt's off. Looks like all the hoses are there, the condenser's there. Um, I'm seeing most of the parts for the AC. Maybe needs an uh, AC pump. Feels like that baby's... Oh, it's not froze up. Um, definitely needs a clutch though. Alternator looks new. Supercar. Beautiful under the hood. 1971 Cutlass convertible. This one's not going to last long. I think we only had the last one we had in our shop for about a week and it was gone, guys. Give Tom a call today. 248-974-9513. We'll uh, answer any more questions, get you any more pictures. Super, super car.